and welcome back to my channel! Today we are back again with another speed building video here on my channel. Um, today we are building another one pack challenge. This time around we are using the fitness stuff pack plus space game starter room. So if you guys are curious oops, sorry, as to how I did this build, then keep on watching. Anyways, um, this build mainly used those packs so you guys will see a lot of um, items from fitness stuff because I decided to um, of course do this build with that pack so as you can see right now I um, built it on a diagonal way on a with a diagonal shape the reason behind that is because one I like the idea of having it very um, in a diagonal angle just because of the I got the idea from the windows it's very geometrical it's very um angry <laughs> um and yeah I like I like how it looked and of course one is also that I could save money from building with a diagonal shape although it's very hard to furnish a diagonal shaped house it is far more affordable than any other um than doing the normal shaped house just because it uses um not a lot of walls not a lot of um not a lot of walls not a lot of love <laughs> lot of um, wallpapers so i did save a lot of money and i was able to use most of the items from the game pack or not game pack the stuff pack the only things that i didn't use from the stuff pack were a plant what else the wall decor the very big wall decor um the other gym equipment a table i think yeah the tables i didn't really use the end table and the dining table just because that was just too big for the space and what else did i not use hmm. i can't really think of the other things that i didn't use i guess i didn't use the different um lengths of the um, the ceiling light which by the way that is one of my most favorite lights lights <laughs> lights in the game just because it looks so good it looks so modern and if you guys know me and you have been with me for a long time you will know that I love 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 modern builds I mean if you guys scroll through my feed or my youtube channel you will see that there are a lot of modern modern builds <sighs> Oh my gosh i'm out of breath and i don't know how to talk but anyways if you guys are enjoying this video don't forget to leave a like so that i mean i can feel your support guys <laughs> and yeah anyways the color scheme for this house is very obvious already it's very earth toned there are a lot of blacks a lot of i mean there are some golds in there like the bathroom is gold and then whites and yeah that's um, basically the color scheme of the whole house. Later on, this um, the shape for the house will change later because I really wanted to use a lot of the um, fitness stuff items and I really wanted to use the bathtub. So later on, this build will get bigger yeah, so that I could fit more of the items. Plus, we had a lot of extra money to spend, so I decided to do that. And yeah, anyways, if you are new to my channel and to my other social 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 media accounts, my links will pop up um, in a little bit. And hopefully, you guys will follow me there on Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, Instagram, and of course on The Sims for Calorie, where I upload my builds and. For you for your sims to um, use them and live in them yeah as you can see here are my links the only um the only handle that is different is twitter and gallery both of those have capital p's and no space and yeah anyways we are almost done with the build it's a very short build since it's just um a starter home plus it's a one pack challenge so there's not really any items that i am um choosing from so it's easier to furnish um, houses just because of the restriction and yeah at this clip right now I will delete those foliages and adjust the house to add a room for a tiny um, work up work up <laughs> workout area wherein I put the 
treadmill. I only placed the treadmill there. And yeah, I added the tub because I really do want to put the tub there. I rearranged it, although it's very inconvenient to have that see-through glass door for the bathroom. But I mean, Sims won't mind. But in real life, I would really mind that. But anyways, we're almost done with the build. So I think I will end my commentary here. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching, guys. If you did enjoy the video, pinch that like button down below. If you have any comments, suggestions, opinions, or I mean just about anything that you guys want to share with us here on my channel, don't be afraid to comment it down below because I do enjoy reading your comments and your suggestions and of course your opinions on anything that I do in my channel. So yeah. And of course, if you are new to my channel, I would really, really, really appreciate it if you guys could subscribe because I built this channel to share my creations to you guys, not only to the Sims community, but of course, also to those who are interested in my videos, in my contents, and the things that I make for you guys, and in hopes to give you and your Sims and my other audiences love, joy, and happiness. Again, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you so much for watching guys. I hope you guys did enjoy the video although it's very short. Shorts. <laughs> short, it's very simple. It's kind of bare from the exterior but I kind of love the way um, the shape of the house just because it adds some spunk to the build. It adds personality to the build. And yeah, you kind of get the vibe of the house just from looking at it from the from the outside because of those all of those shapes from the windows the doors and then when you go inside it's very edgy there are a lot of um sharp edges and yeah i really do love this build it's very simple although it's very um neutral in color monochrome i think yeah but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed i love you all so 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 much and i hope to see you guys on my next video bye